Welcome back. Now, Eastern Cape Education accounts for a quarter of all complaints laid with the South African Human Rights Commission within that province. And in the latest incident, a video has surfaced of pupils left alone while teachers party during an excursion. The department says it will take swift action against any teachers found guilty of wrongdoing. ENC's Ronald Masinda reports the commission will release a report on Thursday. Eastern Cape Education MEC Fundi Lagadi says he's disturbed by images that did the rounds on social media recently of children sleeping on the floor. That's after educators from a school in Tabangulu left them and went out partying during an excursion. We have since sent uh, the investigation team and they have pre brought uh, the preliminary uh, report uh, to myself because I wanted us to deal with that matter as a matter of agency because it is one of those uh, issues that makes the public to lose confidence and trust into the public um, schooling system that we have. We, we are closing um, that investigation. This is just one of many incidents that the SA Human Rights Commission in the province is looking into. The SA Human Rights Commission's provincial head, Elin Carter, says they are working closely with education authorities to deal with these problems. The Department of Education in the Eastern Cape is unfortunately our biggest respondent, which means that we receive the most cases against this one single department in the province. Uh, about 20 25% of all our, our complaints are education related. So we have several open investigations that we are looking into. The outcome of the investigation is expected on Thursday. Ronald Masinda, East London.